Hey guys, what is going on? It is Psycho Sibs Gaming, and welcome back to another episode of Slot or Not. Now, many of you may not know what this series is about because I started it quite a long time ago and I never really kept it running. Well, hopefully, we can change that today. You see, the series Slot or Not focuses on one upgrade per video. We will take an in depth look at that upgrade, and by the time we're finished with the video, I will have a recommendation on whether or not you should slot the upgrade. So, without further ado, today we're talking about Foot Soldier's secret weapon upgrade. Stick around. You're watching Psycho Civs Gaming. So, the focus of today's video is on a very interesting Foot Soldier upgrade called Liftoff. So essentially what liftoff does is it creates an explosion at the launch when you use your rocket jump. This effectively creates a fourth method for you to deal damage with foot soldier and now all three of foot soldier's special abilities deal damage. However the trade off is that this upgrade costs four slots. It's very reminiscent of a legendary upgrade to be honest, gaining new weaponry and sacrificing a lot of slots. So let's take a closer look at this ability and see whether or not we want to waste our four slots on it. So if we hop into Giddy Park, walk right up next to a wildflower and activate the rocket jump, you can see that right next to the enemy it deals 40 damage. And as we're going to find out, this is indeed the maximum amount of damage you can do with the liftoff rocket jump. And I say maximum because you can actually deal less damage than that. Another attempt on a wildflower from slightly farther away will reveal that on the outskirts of the launch you can deal 10 damage to the enemy. Now in the scope of multiplayer, 10 damage is nearly negligible, so you're going to want to be right up against the enemy when you activate your rocket jump. Your other option is to jump above the enemy and activate the rocket jump. This still does connect and oftentimes I find this is the best way to connect a full 40 damage rocket jump with an enemy. Another interesting thing to note is that I did test the rocket jump out on these targets and as you can see I was able to hit that smaller amount of damage, that 10 damage, on the target above me too. So this damage range isn't necessarily two-dimensional it's not a radius on the ground per se as it is the surface area of a sphere so essentially you're going to deal 40 damage at the core of the rocket jump and then a short distance away from the center whether that's up left right doesn't matter you're going to be doing around 10 damage now i did manage to hit one weird 13 damage in here which implies that it could be a spectrum but i doubt that and i'm going to stick with 40 and 10 as my core values but I know most of you guys don't care about that math mumbo jumbo, so I went ahead into some games and tested this out for myself to see whether it was practical to use the rocket jump at all. And from my experience, I'd say that the rocket jump is hard to land, and not necessarily just hard to land to deal any damage, but hard to land to get that full 40 damage. As you can see, that sunflower I just jumped over, I could have sworn that would have been a perfect 40. I thought it was directly over her. But no, only 10 damage. And even when I did get better at landing the liftoff explosion, I just found that it's very, very situational. Most of the time when you're playing foot soldier, you're not rushing right up neck and neck with the enemy. That's more for super brains or for chomper. I feel like I spent so much time trying to land these rocket explosions that I was wasting a lot of potential damage I could have simply been doing with my primary weapon. So in the end, because of its low damage, its difficulty to land, and its relatively situational use, I am going to recommend that you do not use your 4 slots on liftoff. There are better upgrades for foot soldier out there. Do not waste your 4 slots on this jumpy jumpy explosion. Alright guys, that's going to wrap up today's video. If you have an upgrade that you would like me to review for next time, then be sure to drop it in the comment section below. Also, you're seeing Warzone on the screen right now because I have been playing quite a bit of Warzone lately. If that's something you guys want to see on this channel or just some fun gameplays or whatnot, 
or maybe even live streams, let me know. Otherwise, I'll see you next time. Game on, gamers.